Blue when you blew. Me when me me. Oh my f god. It's always funny as hell to see the like Navi in normal like human clothes. It's f weird, right? I, I really do think it's very funny how f massive the avatars are next to human. But also, like, putting Avatar, like, the Na'vi in normal human clothes is also pretty funny. No dinner for any of you. Oh my god, they're taking my bread away. No bread! Not a single one of you gets a loaf of bread! We're taking your bread away! They took my f bread! Oh! What is that? How long is that into the stream? 12 minutes? Kid kid gets shot? 12 minutes into the stream. Wild. It only took 12 minutes for him to shoot a child. That's crazy. This man has no patience. These kids don't have any key cards or anything. Duh. Stop right there! Stop it! Is this a big facility with multiple different doors? Don't you have trank guns for this? There is no fucking way that you had to shoot this kid. 12 minutes to child death. There is no fucking reason in any way, shape, or form that this guy had to shoot that kid. He's just a dickhead. Listen, I had to shoot that blue kid. I had to. Oh yeah, get up on your fucking step stool, dipshit. Me with my gun. Put him down. Why don't you run at them? You're beefy and big. I would fucking, I would rip them asunder. There we go, fuck yeah. Great job, teacher. Holy shit, look at the gamer DX racer chairs that we're running away from. We gotta go. Do I get to play that? No. I think that Avatar is a uh, uh, postmodern cats. What about you? I'm saying it. Avatar is just cats, but postmodern. I'm saying it. I'm not worried about it. I'm saying it. Look at the Oh, feet, 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 feet. I saw feet, feet, feet spotted. Blue feet spotted. You think Avatar feet taste like blue raspberry, or do you think they just taste like feet? Question for the chat. You're not wrong, but don't say it. Yeah, don't fuck with me and my one big toe. If Avatar is cats, then which Avatar is James Corden? A uh, trick question. Avatars can't be fat. I'm sorry. That's so fucking mean of me. That's so fucking rude of me to say. I, I can't believe I fucking snapped right back with that. That's so fucked up. You, you expect different body shapes for Avatar? Are you crazy? Now, I'm fine being a Navi, and I love my history and my clan. But let me tell you something. We gotta take all the Dr. Pepper out of this facility this instance. I can't live without a big sip of Dr. Pepper. You're telling me that Navi don't drink cola? No 23 flavor soda? Fuck, dude, this is ridiculous. I'm gonna start freaking out. Did they call you the cream walker? I am a cream walker. This is so true. Did we? This is so true, true. Did everyone make it? Oh, you got some normal Normans here. You got some tiny people. Oh, who all made it? I'm so large. You know what's crazy about playing an Avatar game is I finally feel my height. I finally get to feel like I'm a six foot five uh, warrior in a, in a world of uh, people at like uh, under six foot. Oh, I'm the cream walker. Did you get older in cryo sleep? Can I see my feet? Holy shit. Oh my God. Look at this shit. Oh, look at how tiny you humans are. So tiny, so small. I will crush you like grape in hand. I will I will put you in cranberry bog and squish you with toe. I fucking love opening the food wheel and using X to consume food. Who else out there love opening up the food wheel and pressing X to consume the food? Get rid of them. Delete them from their pods. Oh shit, I have to go. Do I get to control it? Nope. Oh, now I do. Oh, fuck. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. They're after me. The RDA. They're after me. Huh? I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. Left? No. Right. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. I can't wait to get into the open world and- Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. You gotta slide. I can't wait to get into the open world and find me a tower. They put me in one of these when I was a baby. Gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. Oh, shit. I gotta get out of here. Oh, my God. What's with the fucking spring heel jump here? My punchies? Oh, shit. I gotta get out of here. Oh, fuck. Slide. Oh, you do have a strong jump. I wish I could drop like a- you know how some people can drop like a cruise missile? You know how like uh, the US military or if Call of Duty you get enough kill points to drop a cruise missile? I wish I could do that for like uh, rounding people. Sir? Yeah? We've done it. Yeah? He's round. Nice. Great job, everybody. Get me a kill streak that just makes all the enemy team just a little bit wider. Really fuck him up crazy style. Rounding him now, sir. There we go. Nice punchies. Look at all that strength. Oh, fuck. These guys suck shit at shoots. Grow the fuck up. Get a better grun. Oh, shit. Oh, nice one, dipshit. I bet you can't even hit me. No, you can't hit me. They can't hurt you. 
Don't do that. Don't do that. They can't hurt you. And what, so what you What's want is Call of Duty but with Dig Dug. Shall yeah. Let. Put the what Dig Dug the bicycle pump as a kill streak. I am here. So you hit somebody with it and they the just inflate into the sky. I think it'd be really cool if you were an avatar and you could pick up a drill. You know, if you are an avatar and the size of an avatar, you could use so many different things as weapons. You could use the jaws of life as a weapon. You could just smash people. Shitting, farting, pissing, squarting, kill them. Fucking get them. Fucking pop them. Another one? Where another one at? Come on. You got any more? I just knocked them the fuck out. You just punched them halfway across the screen. Gather wood from the archer's thicket. The what? I don't know what that looks like, bitch. Is that wood? Uh, let me punch a tree, dipshit. Why give me... I think it showed a quest marker for a bit. Oh. Oh. I sneer. Oh my god. Horizon Zero yawn. I love Avatar because as a video game experience, the nauseating like colors and everything all blend in together. Where's he at? Can I hit him? Headshot! Fucking got him. How do I- Oh god, why the fuck does it have this much health? What did I do? I fucked up. I fucked up. I, I'm dead. Sometimes that's just the way that it do BSB. Sometimes you see a really weird dog and you gotta shoot it. The 511s are gonna try to cancel this. The the shorts are out in abundance today. They're very angry about Avatar the game. You gotta go and learn- I gotta go and learn how to get the Healy Wheelie. The Healy Wheelie Dealy. I love that um because I brought those weird dogs over to the soldiers where I killed them, they're all just fighting the weird dogs now. Fucking bozos. No, I said leave me alone. I'm grabbing pods. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I upset nature. I upset nature. Let me out of here. Get me, get me out of here. I am going to punch you really hard, Avatar style. Pop. Here he goes. Here. Your pod. You learn fast. Here, take this jewel. Here. Yumpy. Smoke it out the health bong. Oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> oh. 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 This is how we heal. Oh, big grub. Holy shit. Holy crap. They have a fat doobie tree. Dude, they just be smoking the big weed out the tree every day. Pandorian Zaza disrupting my circadian rhythm. What does fucking with your hair even feel like? I would assume it's just a cum button, right? It's like the hair's made of prostate. I don't know. I don't know how alien biology work. It all kind of fucked up. James Cameron wrote this shit and was like really fucking losing it. And then it made him billion dollars. Then everybody was making fun of the fact he was talking about sequels. And then he's like, yeah, we're making like 12 sequels. And everybody was like, no fucking way. Nobody's going to go see that. And then everybody went and got, went and saw it. And then it made a billion fucking dollars. And they're going to make another one. And everybody's going to be like, we're not going to go fucking see that. And then everybody's going to go fucking see it. They're going to make a billion dollars again. Avatar is always wild to me because I genuinely fucking have no clue. How every- both of the movies that have come out made a billion fucking dollars, because I- I've never talked to anybody about these movies. A pandrillion dollars. There were jokes for days when they were talking about the Avatar Cinematic Universe. Jokes for fucking years about it. And then, motherfucker, the second one came out and then it made a billion magillion dollars. They look pretty. I- like, that's it. A magilla gorillion dollars. Because the movie look pretty. I guess it's gotta do something right if people get genuinely depressed about never not living on Pandora. Oh, what, post-Avatar Syndrome? Post-Avatar- uh, Post-Avatar Syndrome is like a real thing is insane to me. Like, Avatar? Really? Avatar? Wait, what? Oh, you don't know about post-Avatar Syndrome? People who get so fucking depressed that they don't live in the world of Avatar that it consumes their every waking thought? Yeah, post-Avatar Syndrome is like a real thing. There are genuinely people who've seen Avatar, and because they have so little media literacy, they latched onto it to the point where, like, they they want to live in the world of the Na'vi, and they can't imagine anything else. Yeah, you don't know about post-Avatar Syndrome. This is crazy. Sorry, you're too big for that ladder. Damn, I can't tower? That's not real? You're lying? No, no, no. Post-Avatar Syndrome is real. This is not a bit. You can Google it. You can look it up. There are genuinely people. It's like uh, The Truman Show. There are people who, uh, after The Truman Show, uh, basically, The Truman Show, the movie with Jim Carrey, started its very own personal mental illness, uh, wherein people genuinely believed that they were Truman Showed. I mean, it's not like a brand new mental illness, but it's like a special flavor of mental illness. But yeah, people genuinely hurt themselves over post-Avatar Syndrome. That's why I could never watch the Avatar movies. I know I'd be susceptible to it. I mean, it's just, it's literally just advanced escapism. It's, it's an advanced level of, like, escapism to the point where it's like, really, Avatar, though? Because, like, there's so many way cooler movies with way cooler universes. Like, you don't want to live in Fern Gully. There's not, like, post-Fern Gully syndrome. Oh, they sell bows with rarity. Wow! Brendan, you getting post-Avatar Syndrome because that planet is in Iowa and anywhere is better than Iowa? Listen, I... I am very much of the mindset, right? Where, like, I... 
live in reality. No matter how depressing reality is, I live in reality. I live in the now now. Some people want to live in the then then. But I speak the true true. I live in the now now. Avatar Planet Weed so fucking stanky that it reconfigures your DNA. God, everyone is so small, it's fucking with me. This is Brendan's sight. This is literally how I walk around every day of my fucking life. Everybody's so fucking tiny, I don't get it. It's why whenever I have to figure out how tall a celebrity really is, I have to go look up their Conan O'Brien interview to see if Conan stands up next to them. Because, like, Conan is my height, so I have to be like, okay, how short are they in comparison to Conan O'Brien? Conan's really helpful for that. Oh, grenades! Blue bomb! Somehow the 2008 Avatar game is better so far. Listen, I played that, like, what is it, four months ago? It's not. This one doesn't have the uh, horrible Gaussian blur, and I'm thankful for that. I think a lot of people forgot that that had horrible, nasty Gaussian blur. Made the game almost unplayable. Uh, how do I get the food? Do I, oh, do I get to receive new gear? I do not know, my friends. I would love my oh, brand new bracelets. Awesome. Let me get my shirt and my pants. Oh, dude, you need spare parts to be able to collect the superior rarity shorts. Awesome. Where's the cash shop at? Can we look at the cash shop for Avatar? Who's putting their money into the fucking Avatar bucks? Well, out there, how many, how many, how many people putting their money into Avatar bucks? Crazy amount of money to Avatar bucks. He's oh my fucking God. How much dip He's could the Navi bad. consume? Well, it's On a scale of one down, pound of dip to ten nice. pounds of dip. How much dip could the Navi consume? If you hand a, like a circular tin of skull to the Navi, will they just eat it? Do they even know how to pack a lip? Pack a lip full of dip? Oh, I see. You can track the... Whoa, look at that. Orange line. Whoa. Orange line, dude. Find that node. Whoa, node. What is this? What is this? Oh my god, this is such a PS2 licensed video game with a hacking minigame that's entirely original to the fucking game. Oh my god, this is such a PS2 licensed game. What if Pac-Man, but hacking, Hackman? My favorite kind of cutscenes are when the blue people just stand around and talk at me. It's very cool. Yeah, I'm pretty sure every cutscene so far has been blue people talk at you about blue people things. They're talking to you about the fungus. You were a baby, abducted baby. Now you have to go and blue yourself. Are you not entertained? They are all so blue! I want to get into some of the killing and some of the chilling. Want to get me my uh, bird? Your You're yeah, as an avatar, you get like a bird, right? As like a Navi, you get like a free bird. Run, run, little, run, run, little person, run! I'm gonna get you! I'm gonna get you! I'm gonna step on you! Watch out! Ooh, I'm gonna get you! Yeah, that's right. You better keep fucking running. What are you gonna get into the fridge here, huh? You're fucking small, short. What were you doing? I fucking saw that. Do it again. Play your idol animation. I fucking saw you. Think I didn't fucking see you, dipshit? Do it. I fucking dare you to play that broom like a guitar. I dare you to do it again. I saw you. What is that sloppy toppy you're eating there? Fat meat? You're eating that fucking big salmon? Hey, can I have a bite? Hey. Hey, can I have a bite? Hey, what if I tickle you with my toes just a little bit? You don't mind if I do a little toe tickling, right? I'll, I, no, you can just hand me, you can just hand me that meat. I'll grab it with my foot. No, no, you just hand me a little piece of meat. I'll just grab it with my foot. Don't worry about it. Yeah, just a little. Uh, you sure? Just a little. Just a little bit. No. Just a little bit. No. Can I just have a little piece of it? No. Can I just have a little bit of it? No. <laughs> but can I? I just want a little piece of meat. Come on. I'll just grab it with my toe. No. Come on. Just let me grab a little piece of meat. Come on. No. Come on. Just a little piece of fruit. No. All right. Fine. I'll ask somebody else. Hey, can I have a bite of that plate? Just a little piece. No. Just a, just a, just a little, just a little piece of just a little piece of fruit. Can I have just a little piece of fruit? Come on, just give me a, just give me a little piece of fruit. Come on, I deserve a little piece of, a, just a little piece of fruit. Come on, come on. Just a little piece, just a little, just a little, just a little piece of fruit. No, okay. I love that you can slowly move your foot towards them. Oh, is that fruit? Can I just have a little piece? Can I just have a little piece? Just a little, just a little, just a little piece of fruit. Just a little. <laughs> No, I, I, I'm really ambidextrous with my feet. Ripping the grippers. I'm I'm the grip ripper. I love Ubisoft towers. I can't wait to climb them. Yay! I love Ubisoft towers. I can't wait to climb them. Yay! To defeat that pneumatic tower. Let's freaking go, dude. We're in the game now. I mean, I'm not gonna fucking lie. The game looks gorgeous for like what it is, right? But also. 
uh, my biggest problem with uh, Avatar, and this may be some other people's problems, is like Avatar is too much visual noise. IMO, it has always been the way for me, is I think Avatar is way too much visual noise. I can't parse any of it. Be it a game, be it like the, the movies, be it like watching a trailer or something. I feel like all of it is so much fucking visual noise, I can't register. Oh, sorry. Let me, uh, she's stroking my, she's stroking, she's stroking my dick until I, she's stroking my, let me just, she's stroking, oh. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, how do you work the shaft? Is it, uh, do you get really crazy with it, really technical with it, or are you just up and down, up and down, up and down, up and down? Do you want to get really crazy with it, or do you want to... Down, up, down, up, down... Oh, yeah. Oh, sorry, I got it gently. Find the right angle. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Pull that thing out, baby. I'm the Shaft Shaman, yeah! Fuck you, industry! We hate the motions of industry and the fuels of war. We love nature and slime and blue. There ain't no way. Wait. Did I bullshit it? I bullshitted it. Never mind. Fuck off. Okay, you just you just bullshit it. I mean, I'm a Navi. I should be allowed to climb. Ooh, a big umbrella. I should be able to like able to climb up any surface. Don't Navi have like suckers on their hands, like an octopus? No. Yeah, they have like octopus hands, right? They fucking love like climbing up the walls with their sucker hands. I would love to see a Navi in New York City climbing up the Empire State Building, throwing a guy off the top of the Empire State Building. Whoa. Hair! Brendan, they don't have sucker hands. What are you talking about? You clearly don't know Avatar. You've never seen a movie. Obviously, you have no idea. They have sucker hands. They have hair tentacles. Duh. Air boost! Whoa! Navi have double jump? That's crazy. I didn't know that. Nobody ever told me that the Navi had double jump. That's crazy. They got that in the movie? They just like Mario. Why do you not have an accent? Oh, like the my Navi? Uh, they watch a lot of... Uh, uh, they watch a lot of, uh, uh, they watch a lot of, uh, sitcoms on the TV. That why? Man would not admit that his Navi watched a shit ton of Family Guy. This is true, actually. Sorry, this is true, true. So many awesome, unique choices. Isn't that awesome? Isn't that cool? You can go to your skill tree and look. More, better crouch. Double. Crouching, 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 crouch. Generic stealth skill tree. Damage bonus, damage bonus, damage bonus. Go to here. Health bonus. Resistance, resistance, health bonus, health bonus, health bonus. Oh, health pouch capacity increased. Energy, energy, energy. I'm on my way back to HQ. See you soon. Dude, I love getting plus 7% to my Navi pouch. It's so fucking epic. Whoa, we have a pollution meter. Holy shit, they finally put it. The Domino's pizza tracker in a video game at launch. Holy Here, shit! You want to order a pepperoni pizza? The oh, fuck yeah. Now we just gotta wait, right? Darren is bringing you a pepperoni pizza. How's he gonna get to Pandora? Fuck, dude. Darren's gonna take 50 years to get me my fucking pizza. It is your life's journey for the world to see. For you to remember. Oh, just like how Jason in Far Cry 3 uh, got his tattoos, remember? Same thing. Why do every Far Cry game and Far Cry like gotta be like, here's the thing you put in your arm? It's your arm thing. Here, here's your arm thing. Enjoy your arm thing because it's a Far Cry like. Ubisoft make any other kind of video game challenge any percent. Ubisoft making anything that's not Far Cry or Assassin's Creed or Watch Dogs any percent. Any percent challenge, dude. Oh, I got a bead for my song cord. Whoa. That shit crazy. I ain't got no shoes. Hey, we get Rayman sometimes. Okay, when was the last Rayman? 2013? Sometimes? When did uh, Legends come out? 10 years ago? Brendan, you just said the same thing three times. Oh, true. Oh, is the song core just Jason's tattoos? Uh, pretty much. It tells you of your journey. Your journey real. Yeah, isn't Rayman like 10 years fucking old? I'm sorry, Rayman fans. Oh, well, no, Raving Rabbids. Raving Rabbids is like genuinely an interesting thing from Ubisoft. Wait a minute here. Raving Rabbids, you know, For Honor, right? <laughs> you remember For Honor? Oh my fucking god, Witcher Vision, we have to track footprints, this is crazy. That's right, gamers. We got feet sniffing technology in the game now. I don't know, I fucking hate these plants that like... 
Oh my, am I finally getting the title card? What the fuck? Why are you giving me the title card now? You don't need to give me the title card. Oh my fucking god, because it's gonna zoom out, isn't it? I'm gonna get to the top of the- Fuck off! I'm gonna get to the top of the hill here, on the cliff. A bird! I'm gonna get to the top of the hill on the cliff here, and then it's gonna be like, the game title. An hour and- Oh my fucking god, this is so title carded. Fuck off! Now zoom out and show my character. Zoom out here, Breath of the Wild me. Do it. Whoa. There it is, fuck you. They're trying to take our unobtainium. Please don't take my unobtainium. Please, I need that unobtainium, it's mine. Please don't take it. I need it. I'm gonna make cell phone batteries with it. Please, humans need to be able to make more cell phone batteries. Let us rip your planet. Let us steal all your natural resources, please. It looks good, it's just, uh, Avatar. Avatar is so, oh wait, I gotta, I gotta go. I gotta go, I gotta go, Avatar! Into the water! You will die on impact. I am not dead on impact. This game sucks. I forgot that this was timed. I have to go. My people need me. They need my help. The humans are attacking. We have to kill them now. Still have not seen an Avatar movie. And I think it's way funnier to experience Avatar without having seen the movies. I think it's really funny to experience Avatar only through the video games. Which means I don't know shit about fuck except they big, they blue, and they eat the fruit out the tree. I don't even think that Avatar, like, I didn't even think that Na'vi ate. I thought they, like, photosynthesized and shit. I thought that's why they was blue. But they don't even do that. They don't even photosynthesize. I was lied to. Did you know they have hair sex? I do know about the hair sex from cultural osmosis. Weird dogs. Keep on running. Run away from those weird dogs. Don't pay any attention to the weird dogs. You just gotta keep going. The RDA is attacking. The small humans are trying to kill. Oh, they're all dead. Cool time limit, bro. All dead anyway. Doesn't matter. If they photosynthesized, they'd be green, they not blue, this? dumbass. Uh, okay. Then explain blue flowers. Now, quick. Go to Panera Bread. Buy the turbo lemonade. Drink three. Then die. Dude, I think the Panera Bread turbocharged lemonade thing is fucking wild to me, only because of the fact that apparently they were just treating it like it was normal lemonade, so I was reading through a bunch of shit about the turbo lemonade, and, like, people were just buying it for their kids. And that thing had... 390 milligrams of caffeine. More than, like, a bang. What is that? Oh, did you not know about the murder lemonade? Uh, Panera was selling murder lemonade. Are you talking about my grenades? I'm slinging murder lemonade. I'll never see it coming. Oh my god, waves and waves of guy. Okay, now I'm curious about murder lemonade. Essentially, here's what was happening is... Panera has... has... Uh, unwittingly... I mean, not unwittingly, but, like, they basically two people have died. Uh, do you think the fact will, that it kills people increase or decrease sales? Increase sales, I'm not gonna lie. I think more people are gonna be like, dude, I wanna try the murder lemonade now. I hate that archery is left-handed, but guns are right-handed. Well, I have news for you, Buster. Right-handed mode? Left-handed mode. Uh, ew, 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 ew. How do I change it back? How do I, how do I? Oh my god. Thank god, okay. Weird the amount, the amount of, like, accessibility in this game is wild, especially for Ubisoft slop. But yeah, I mean, so to explain, uh, god, in a way that I can parse through my brain hole to be able to explain this. Uh, essentially, Panera was selling lemonade as turbo lemonade that had like 390 milligrams of caffeine in it. A monster is like 200 milligrams of caffeine, a bang is like 300. 400 is like the daily maximum for human consumption. And two people have died because they were just drinking them like soda pops. I think the last person who died from them literally ingested 1100 milligrams of caffeine. So, Panera, two people have died drinking their lemonade because they literally just had it up on display next to green tea and black tea. I was reading comments uh, about the lemonade, and apparently parents were just buying it for their kids without knowing that it had 390 milligrams of caffeine in it. And this is like a current thing. Like, this happened within the last week. Somebody died because of this. This isn't like a thing that happened in the 90s. This is a thing that happened this year, in the last month. Yeah, Panera, Panera unwillingly, like unwittingly, not unwillingly, but unwittingly killed uh, two people. Insanity. The fact that you wouldn't advertise that at, like properly is like a, hey, there is a not safe amount, there is an amount of consumption that you should not have as many. This game is incorrect on how to use a bow. You're supposed to draw with your dominant hand. Well, um, the Navi are built different, so... Grow up, maybe? War. War never changes. 
Until the war changes and everybody's blue. Now war has changed. I can't believe they have something with over 300 milligrams of caffeine refillable. That's what I'm saying. Dude, when I go to any other place and they've got like a turbocharged like, oh, here's a big juice drink with a bunch of caffeine in it. It's like 200, maybe 100 to 200 milligrams at most. It's like a Red Bull. Like Scooters. Scooters is an American, more Midwestern, I feel, um, coffee brand or like coffee place. And they have this like thing where you can get like a funny smoothie and they just dump a Red Bull in there. It's like, oh, I can like drink a Red Bull. That's fine. I'm like, that's cool, dog. But the amount, the sheer amount of caffeine with refills. Find the largest tree in the Silkwoods of the King Glor Forest. I love Avatar it will always and forever. Um, feel like a fake property to me. I don't know if anybody else has this issue, but Avatar to me has always felt like it's not real. You know when you watch a movie and you see a video game in the background or they're talking about a movie? That's what, a that's what Avatar has always felt like to me, is a, a fake property. It doesn't feel real. It's like, ah, oh, dude, awesome. Uh, like, you get your brand new, uh, Popley Hopley adoid. Awesome, cool, what does that mean? I, I don't fucking know. I don't fucking know. I don't fuck. I don't fucking know. Why you expect me to be? I don't fucking know. You expect me to? I don't fucking know, bitch. I ain't no shit, bitch. I don't, know. I don't fucking know. What? To me, at least, like, when I was in high school and Avatar 1 came out and everybody was like, dude, you gotta go see it. Dude, you gotta go see it. It's so fuck. Oh, fuck you! Hey, guess who just got some store token? Oh, fuck yeah, dude. I got me my Avi coins. I forgot. Oh my god, the Ubi Slop Shop. All of this looks the same to me. None of it looks different. This is all the same to me. I don't see anything different about this. All of this looks exactly the same. Pay $80. Pay $130 for your Ubi game. Buy more of our slop, please. What? Do you want me to parse the visual nausea that is this game to be able to fucking find treasure for a quest? Because if so, fuck you. What does this mean? The Shadowwood Domain? Wow, I wish I could see fucking anything, dog. Where's the Shadowwood Domain? I don't even know what that is. I'm sorry, that's going into the uh, never doing that bitch. That's going into the never doing that bitch pile. You want me to parse the visual nausea of this fucking slop? No, thank you. I'd rather not. Is that the poo-poo? That's the poo-poo. I gotta go get the poo-poo. You ever see, like, a thing in a video game and it, like, rattles your brain so fucking hard that you can't parse any, any normal human thought? That's how I feel playing this game, is, like, I am... Unable to process normal human thought, and I'm wondering if that's the way the people are when they watch Avatar. Is that how it is? Is that how it's supposed to be? Yeah, welcome to my tree. Enjoy the accoutrements. Please be one in the tree. I know nothing. Do they? Do they like? Do they like Yoda? Do the Navi like Star Wars? How do they feel about Star Wars? If I showed him Star Wars, would they be like, "Whoa, that crazy! That little green guy, love him." Hidden fruit. Why? And Why'd they hide that fruit? Hiding fruit where you are. <laughs> Hungry I am. Oh, fuck. Part of me was just this was kind of like the PS3 Avatar game where you could play as the humans or the Navi, because I think it'd be funny. Let me be a asshole industrialist. Let me pollute the planet, please. No, you have to use the Bonero and you have to walk around and talk to the blue people and let them talk at you. I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. I know how video games work. I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. Really hate how gangly they are. Yeah, they kind of look like they all went through the taffy puller, right? You know when Willy Wonka, where one of the kids goes through the taffy puller? Fucking crazy, dude. Look at these clothes. Pitiful. Did you just fucking knock my fit? What the fuck? Like your your fit. Whack. They your brain. Whack. Dress. Your song weave. Rough Whack. Your ancestors. Whack. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. Your drip is lacking, child. Head over to the Ubisoft shop right now and buy new drip. It'd be fucking wild if video game characters told you to go to the microtransactional store. I would lose my mind if a video game character said, You look like you have clothes, but you could get nicer clothes in the Ubisoft avatar store. Well, you're so right. I should go to the Ubisoft. I should buy the I should buy the Zeswa Warrior cosmetic pack, huh? Yes, it is a good cosmetic pack, and we all love it. Am I insane for thinking that fucking crafting materials don't need rarity on them? Troublemakers. Yeah, am I fucked up and crazy if I think that maybe crafting materials don't need rarity attached? Bro, just look at the fucking when you open your fucking. That's a. That's a fine level pelt. These are some 
Fine level bamboo shoots. What do you want to help in the bar? Yes. Uh, you remember when Ubisoft pulled back a little bit on the RPG stuff and then they said, hey, no, actually, fuck you. Mushroom and meat. Make me a meal. I'm cooking. Look at me cooking. Yabba dabba doobop, me making some stew. Yabba dabba doobop, it look real good too. I'm making some hidden fruit meat. Yumpy. I'm steaming all these hams. Mm mm mm. Steam ham. Yum. Yes. 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 You have to put bamboo shoots on your bow to make your bow stronger. Yes! Why do we need RPG stats everywhere? Because pain is misery and misery is pain and suffering is suffering and suffering is pain and misery is suffering and suffering is pain. And, suffering is suffering is pain. and everything, oh dude, don't you fucking want plus 8% weak spot damage on your bow? Dude, don't you want plus 5% poo poo damage on your nightstick? Don't you want five Danganronpas on your trigger trigger happy havoc? Dude, it's so fucking awesome. Don't you want a plus five Dilbert to your to your Dilburito meal? What twelve ham sandwich damage to your fucking gun? And then oh and then cool. Nothing is more immersive than a bunch of fucking numbers, dude. I love percentages and numbers. Thanks, Borderlands and Destiny. If I could delete two video games from existence, it'd probably be Borderlands and Destiny. And Diablo. Those all those all th those three, we could delete them and the world would be a lot better. Gaming would be saved. I don't care if we miss out on good video game moments. You delete Destiny, Diablo, and Borderlands. And honestly, you just de delete, like, Diablo 1. You eradicate Diablo 1, you make it so it never happened. Diablo 1, 2, or 3, or 4. You just eradicate them. I don't care how good Diablo 2 is. I don't care how good it was. I don't care how good it is. I blame Diablo 2 for loot rarity. That's the originator. I'm in the King Lore Nest right now. This is so awesome. Just delete it. Who hurt you? Me, loot rarity in video games. Delete those games. I'm so fucking sick and tired of plus 3% elemental resistance. I'm so fucking dog shit tired of plus 5% critical hit chance. I'm so fucking tired of it. I'm so tired of it. You know what's awesome? Curated loot that actually feels like it, it makes a difference. Yeah, I would love that. Man, I wish video games were like that again. Remember when Redfall had a bunch of cool guns and all the guns were literally just like the normal guns, but it was just percentage increases instead of anything interesting? I mean, by it's all accounts, this game is, it, like, it, this game is fine, you. right? Have you seen like, I have nice things to say about it. Up. It's fine. It's like the average level of slop. There's gonna be one person who, like, paints themselves blue. That'll be really be upset careful, that this Mal. isn't at the Game Awards, oh, right? I feel like they should fast track you into getting a bird. You know when Far Cry, when you just get in a car, like, almost right away? In the bird, just like a car for Avatar. Avatar. Uh, is this game worth it? I'm considering getting it, but I want to see what people think first. Do you like Avatar? Yes, you will like this game. Do you not like Avatar? No. Then you buy I, the game's fine. It's Far Cry, but blue. But I have not seen either of the Avatar movies, so I'm just playing it for funnies. It runs really fine. It's got really cool accessibility settings. If you like blue people, you're gonna fucking lose your mind when they talk about the bobbly hoplioids and the stern beasts and the hot dog reel. I don't know. I don't know fucking anything about Avatar. I just think it's funny to play Avatar games. Give me the bird. I want the bird. I'm an entitled gamer. Hand over my bird. Oh, Avatar hot dog. Real. You can eat the whole warm wiener. $15 for Ubisoft Pass to play this. Not a big deal. 70 fucking dollars. No, thank you. Listen, I do not care about... I care about game ownership unless it's Avatar Skies of Pandora. In which case, $15 is perfect for this game. What do you have, Ubisoft Pass? Because I bought it to play this game for a month. Because I paid 15 bucks, so I didn't have to pay 70. I don't pay for it regularly. Oh, God, no. Oh, oh, dude, Skull and Bones is gonna be so fucking awesome. Oh, I bought it so I could just play the Avatar game. I wish there was more fighting and less talking. I feel like a Dumbo gamer when I say that, but like, oh god, dude. Maybe I need to just do more of the open world slop, but like, oh, me win my worm? Punch that dog. Great job. Punch that dog. Punch that dog. Give thanks to nature. Punch that dog. I'm giving thanks to nature. Thank you, nature, for this beautiful bounty. Thank you, nature. I love nature. Thank you, nature. Come back here, I'm gonna bop you. Come here. Thank you, nature, for this beautiful bounty. Thank you, nature. Clean kill, very merciful. Thank you, nature. Give me that dog meat. So merciful. I was so merciful in that kill. You saw how merciful that was, right, chat? Incredibly merciful. Bludgeoning that dog to death with my big blue fist. So merciful. Me pulling out the big blue blast. So merciful. Check out how merciful this is gonna be. Punch that horse. Horse puncher. Get him! Punch that horse. 
Yes. Come back here. I gotta punch that horse. I gotta be merciful. Come here. Come here. It's mercy. I'm being merciful. Get back over here now, horse. Fine, fine, coward, run away. Using my big blue blast. I promise favors that delight both the palate and the mind. Oh, fuck. Oh, Sounds shit. Uh, welcome to Pandora. Oh, no, I hope you enjoy you your stay. Oh, dear. I, I hope that you find our accoutrements out to your standards. To oh, buddy. Why is Droopy Dog selling me on Avatar? Oh fuck, you have to go and get me three crimson mushrooms. Oh shit. Grab you some shell fruit from the King Lore Forest. Okay, is this a shell fruit? Up and down. Oh. Oh, see how wet that is. Oh shit. You hear that? Oh my god. Do you... Oh, it's so wet. Oh my God. It's so wet, isn't it? Oh, just a gentle pull. Oh, there we go. How do you feel about this? Huh? What if I just work it a little bit, huh? How do you feel about this, huh? Oh, gripping the shaft. Oh, don't mind if I do. Let me just work the tip a little bit. Oh, I gotta get that mushroom and I gotta be good at it too. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I need that pristine crafting material. Oh yeah. Oh, there we go, oh yeah. Look at that crimson mushroom and it's fine too? Oh, of course it's fine, I was handling it right. I need how many of them? Oh, I grabbed one, right? Oh, I need superior, oh, I'll go fuck myself. Fuck that mission, go fuck yourself. Never mind. Yeah. Go fuck yourself, dog shit mission. Dude, I have a fetch quest for you, and it involves the crafting rarity. You get to do so many uh, resource gathering mini games. Isn't that awesome? No, I'll go fuck myself. Don't talk to me again. I'm not making your fucking dog shit stew. Oh, but if you do my dog shit stew, I'll give you a hundred Ubisoft bucks. With streamer, you get to stroke so many mushrooms. Yeah, but I have to do them while it's raining. Because I need them to be rare mushrooms, not not uncommon mushrooms. Which is an incredibly depressing statement that I really have to say. I I'm gonna get I'm gonna get pre-avatar syndrome, you know? This can't get a highlight video. It's I'm going to do it. I'm going to edit this. I I'm going to go. edit this suffering into a I'm palatable, like, 30 minutes. I'm Cooking show where the judge the criticizes contestants on ingredient the rarity. Now go. you went through the, move in fact. the grocery store. And yes, I did go through the, the grocery meat. store. Well, it seems like you passed up the uncommon Scott butter right. and you picked you up the common butter. butter. It's not nice. Well, I didn't know what the green meant. I didn't know that green meant green was uncommon and that the white one was the uncommon one. I thought, I, I didn't know how the, it's, it's rare. You went to the grocery store. You picked up rare milk. But it's my understanding that you passed up legendary rarity milk to get the rare milk. Yeah, well, cool, because it's had a penis on the front of the box. Well, it was legendary milk, mate. It would have tasted better. You failed. You failed my test. Oh, you failed my tricky food test, and now you have to die. I don't know, Gordon Ramsay pulls out a gun that's epic rarity and shoots them. That'd be so cool. Is that the poo-poo fruit? Can I grab that? Do I die? Yep, there I go. I must you gotta go yell at your dog. You gotta go. I fucking... Oh, how do you summon your weird bird? Okay, dude. <laughs>